Practice number eight of Green Bay Packers training camp in the books. The family night practice, despite a lengthy weather delay, 63,000 fans turned out to watch some football and fireworks. The big news of the night, kicker Mason Crosby. During his first four efforts during training camp, he was 22 out of 23 on field goals and made 18 in a row. He made his first four tonight, and then it all went haywire. Crosby missed six out of his last seven. Afterward, coach Mike McCarthy blamed it on the operation, and that would be rookie snapper Derek Hart and rookie punter Justin Vogel. Fixing Crosby absolutely paramount. His last four seasons, he's made 86.7% of his field goal attempts. Before that, a couple of two-minute drills. Aaron Rodgers and the number one offense got into the red zone before fullback Aaron Ripkowski was stripped by Kenny Clark with Clay Matthews recovering. Ripkowski, of course, fumbled in the NFC Championship game. The number two offense, led by Brett Hundley, did get into the end zone. On a fourth and three early in the drive, Hundley found Jamal Williams for a gain of nine. Then Hundley found rookie D'Angelo Yancey for a gain of 22 and rookie Colby Pearson for a gain of 19 to the eight-yard line. On first and goal from the 13, Hundley found rookie tight end Aaron Peck for the touchdown. One big lineup change, rookie Kevin King out, Demarius Randall in at cornerback. The top three corners, Devon House, Quinton Rollins, and Randall. One injury of note, that'd be Pearson, who was injured on that big catch in the two-minute drill. Otherwise, just the four usual suspects, cornerback Dimitri Goodson, outside linebacker Vince Beagle, tight end Bo Sandlin, and defensive tackle Montrevious Adams. The Packers are off on Sunday, a 12.15 p.m. practice on Monday, and 11.45 a.m. on Tuesday.